assalamu alaikum viewers i hope you are fine and doing well today i have started another uh, tutorial series uh, it's about google map um, and mvc asp.net mvc so this is the first tutorial and in this tutorial i am going to um, discuss how can we use google map uh, and mvc and uh, how can we uh, start get started with this uh, Google map thing and MVC so guys this is a I have created a project a new project by the name of MVC Google map application uh, if you are new to this ASP.NET MVC so I have uh, tutorials on ASP.NET MVC you can go and check that out all the tutorials uh, so that you can have an idea how to uh, create and how to do things inside this uh, MVC okay so I have created this uh, project by the name of uh, MVC Google Map application and then I have this home controller inside which we have different actions right so I created a new action by the name of map here which I have already created this is a uh, action result map and for this map I have created a view you can create it by clicking on add view and it will do it for you like this okay and add so I created this map uh, CSHTML map view okay now I want to display a Google map in this view so the first thing which I have to do is I have to call the jQuery script file here right I have to include it here so what I did I came here to the script file and I just dragged and drop okay like this so if you drag and drop it will give a complete and correct path or you can give it by your own like from script and source inside scripts there is a jQuery uh, JavaScript file the next important thing which you have to do is to include the JavaScript Google API okay so from where you can get this JavaScript Google API another important thing if you want to include the script file you have to include inside the header this is very important thing okay so the Google API you can get from here if you give in the Google map Google map JavaScript API key so the first search comes here okay click on this you will have a result look this is the source okay here you have to put the key right so you have to put the key if I clicked here so it generated the key for me and then you just copy and paste it over there right this whole stuff okay I already have it see Google Map API and this is the key got it this is the language I selected which is English region US and uh, these are the libraries which for now we don't need these libraries but in the next tutorial we will need so I will discuss it then later okay because if you see here there is no such library added here okay because I don't here we just mm, it needs to just display the Google map but later on we will be needing these things okay so this these two are the important things the next thing is I created a div okay I give it an ID I want this Google map to be displayed on uh, this map okay on this sorry in this div okay and I give it a height and width and position absolute and over low hidden got it okay after creating this div what I did I came to the script file look script file you can either add the script file here okay down or maybe you can create a separate script file and then 
put this code inside get file and then uh, include that script file here okay there are two ways so i inside this view i created the script okay the first thing is you have to initialize the map right so i initialize the map and i want my map to be bind to this <coughs> id which is this div <coughs> sorry okay so after initializing the map i there are different functions which you can or para parameters which you can pass okay the first thing is zoom how much you want your map to be zoomed okay so if you increase it 14 15 16 it will be more zoomed okay and this is your center okay this is the location this is the late and long it should be in this format this is the location this is the place where i want my map to be centered to be on that position right then we have map type id so here so this is the type of a map which you want okay we have these four types of maps which i have written here one is road map satellite hybrid and this one road map it's if you put this road map here so it will be a normal map uh, 2d map okay then there is a satellite map which will have a photographic map like real kind of a uh, map you will see everything will be kind of real photographic type Map. then we have this one the graphic map plus we have roads and city names and satellite you will not have the roads and city names but here in this hybrid you will have the names as well and then we have this one map with mountains rivers etc so it will include all so you can just put here these things instead of hybrid satellite you can use anything you want zoom control if you want zoom control we have uh, and google map if you see so we have google okay so in google map we have the zoom control like if you want to zoom in zoom out plus and minus sign if you want that just write it down true if you don't want just write down false okay the next thing is zoom control option okay so where you want the position of this zoom control okay look zoom control option this is the option of zoom control what you want you want its position to be where i want its position to be left bottom right then we have street view control i will show you this street view if you drag and then drop on somewhere it will give you um, complete it will take you to the that street with an actual photograph of that place and you can move around to that place so it's if you want it type you know, write down true otherwise false it will not be there street view control option where you want it left bottom then we have map type control option where you want it okay the the map type you can change it from one to another so why i want it here so these are the options okay and uh, let's run it and see okay another thing i have created this action so for this action i will create uh, uh, i will go inside view then share then and layout a link so that we can go to that view okay guys so i have created this uh, link i will give it a name map okay the action name is uh, map and that this is the home controller and then let's run it and check guys so uh, this is the application in running form now i have created this link let's go to that link so this is the map i have given it a proper head and uh, width and height okay so according to that it's like this now look now we will check these options the first thing is it's hybrid okay so it's a photographic map with names see there are names this
this is the street view see if you drag and drop it will take you directly to the street view okay so this is the this was a street view and uh, the next thing is uh, zoom control this is the zoom control this is the zoom control and then we have this uh, street view control street view control where you want left bottom then we have map type control right center to the right and center so if you don't need label remove it you need it this is uh, satellite and this is the another one this one which is having the mountains and stuff and everything so you can select from here by default if you need you can give it this one here this, this. okay so this was uh, the first tutorial about how can we integrate google map in our website web application and how can we get started with google maps so it's very simple jquery and then this uh, google api and then initializing and then these functions causing these functions inside this google map in the initialization and uh, it's simple so thank you guys and in next tutorial we will be discussing how to uh, you know mark or place a marker on google map and on a click how to you know get the location and all the stuff and the next tutorial inshallah thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe my channel for more videos god bless you